as teachers and liaisons, we are in the process of getting weather stations installed at schools, and I want to give you a quick tutorial as to how to set them up once they are installed. One of the things we need to do is make sure they have the latitude and longitude of your location as well as the elevation of your, your site. I'll talk a little bit about how to find that, but also how to log all this information into your display panel so that you're gathering correct data. So one of the first things we're going to do is to go into the setup part of this. And to do that, we're going to hit the done button, which is right here, and the minus button right here at the same time. And we're going to hold them until it changes, goes to receiving from, and it's kind of working there. We're going to hit done over here, and it's going to take us through and toggle us through a few things. Yes, ISS is on. We're retransmitting is on. I'm just hitting done every time. Now I'm going to be putting in our time. And so we're going to put this one in. We are at 11. I'm going to push the right arrow to go to my minutes and change it to 1120. I'm going to go to the right again. And so now we're looking at the date. And today is February 4th, so that part is correct. And our year is down there. Again, if you go up and down, you are going to be changing your times and your dates. That's how we're doing that. I'm going to go to the right one more time. And it's gone back around to my time flashing there. So I'm going to hit Done. Ask for latitude. So our latitude is 36. Point two. It is 36.18, so I routed it to the first decimal point, 36.2, and I'm going to say done because that is correct. And we are at 80.3. This is where it's again, it's 80.28 or something like that. So we are rounding that, and we're going to hit done with that one again. If you wanted to change it, you're going up and down. I need to change my other decimal points. We need to toggle. I'm hitting the left and the right button to move back and forth my place values. And once I'm at 80.3, I'm going to hit done. Now it's asking what time zone that is. If I'm changing my ups and downs, it changes my time zone. We are in Eastern time zone, GMT, which means Greenwich Mean Time. So we are five hours off from that. I'm going to hit done again and toggle to the next one. Daylight savings, we are on auto, so it's going to change that for us. And we are daylight savings time is on. We are off right now, excuse me, because this is the time of year. And our elevation. So our elevation here is we're in that between 850 feet and um, 800 and 900 generally. But here at the 475 Corporate Square Drive, our elevation, our altitude, is 822 feet. We're done. And we have wind cup size for our anemometer is large. We're going to be called good on that one. Rain collector is going down to the hundredth of an inch. And raining season starts January 1. I'm just going to keep that there. And now we're back around to receiving from. Here I'm going to take and I'm going to hold down the done button until all of my data comes back up. So now we're gathering things, and this is sitting outside, so it is um, currently 54 degrees outside. Our barometer is reading it right around 30, so we're right in the middle latitudes. We can see that we've got our cloudy skies, so that's why we're having that. And we, so uh, we're just gathering our data. So using this to be able to do it, along with your manual, you should be able to get this all set up. Thank you so much. Have a great day.